Ah no! It is Monday show of Valorian Super Fate with the brand new Unity the Three from Fate of the Wave. Welcome back everyone listening. Thank you so much. Please welcome back to the host, Mr. Bossy! Welcome! Oh my god, it is another Monday! Monday means we do the show! Woo! Welcome back to the brand new next episode of the show, Lord, and this will say, and oh my god, it is! That was it! The World Cup has finally ended, but on our show, it's not yet. Because we will still have to talk about the matches, the most impressive matches, the in the most interesting one. Um, there are a lot of things to talk because during the season World Cup, 64 matches uh, that have happened through from begins with the match between Russia and Saudi Arabia. You remember remember that day, sir? Were you right there? Must. You must remember because uh it was June fourteenth or thirteenth. Uh June fourteenth. Um we cut the show about uh like uh four days ago, four days before. Um then World Cup started and now World Cup ended. I didn't see it happen too fast. You know, too fast. And what journey it has been. But folks, don't be sad. I know I'm right now, I'm sad too. Because uh, maybe uh, there are some reasons for that first. Uh, you may have uh, your hope for the wrong winning team. Or um, World Cup is over means somebody say, Summer is over too because uh, I know the students, uh, learners, uh, will have. They wait for the World Cup uh, for summer. They just wait for the World Cup. And when it's over, it, it, it is over, then you will say it is uh, summer ends. But um, don't be sad because uh, I'll be here and to sit here and to share with you what uh, some of the matches that had um, made me feel happy and made me feel um, excited for it because um, this is we this is we like we we have witnessed. A great season. It is a great season because, like, uh, we don't think that things gonna happen. Like, uh, we didn't think it's gonna happen, but it did. So, uh, it is out of our hope. So, uh, when I talk about those things and remember one more thing, maybe like this week. Uh, I'm not, uh, going to tell you which day, but maybe, uh, I, I'm having my plans with my producer that maybe in the middle of the week, means this Wednesday, uh, we will have a, an award for the, uh, like, the Red Boots Award, okay, the Red Boots Award, um, I'll be announcing the winner of that boot, ah, uh, gonna be really interesting, you know, go watch it, don't miss that episode, because I'm gonna announce who will receive that, very expensive price, you know, Gone Boot is for the, uh, uh, talented player, great scorer, uh, that, uh, Golden Boot was awarded to Harry Kane for the Team England, so England team, Still had a win, so congratulations to England. And folks, I will be having some of the um, stories to tell you um, 
on the upcoming days later on uh, for tomorrow. Tomorrow's tomorrow or any day, okay? But yet, I'm gonna talk about last night's match <clears throat> and Saturday's match too. And, uh, you know, one thing that, uh, on Friday's show, Mr. Uncle, my uncle, sat here. And to talk to the fans who are really upset because the results of the Team England. But uh, don't be worried, folks, because England, um, on Saturday, uh, they stood at the fourth place. Uh, that was, uh, that, that is also um, their honor because they have traveled through uh, very far long distance and they went to Russia had a great performance of football and they stood at a fourth place so uh, there are so many teams that are hoping to stand at the top four of the season with World Cup like that it is such an honor so congratulations to um, Team England and also uh, my congratulations uh, for winning the bronze medal of the World Cup, it is the Team Belgium. Team Belgium has scored, uh, has beaten uh, England 2-0, uh, like that. Um, so, uh, also congratulate uh, to um, Team Belgium. Did great too. And yesterday's match was great one. You know, between two teams, those two strong teams, okay, very strong. You cannot, you 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 cannot deny that. Very strong team. They compete together, and they have played a very impressive match. Um, I drank coffee at that night yesterday's night, and um, that is the way I stay awake and. To watch a match like that, uh, that was pleased uh, to uh, any of the football fans, soccer fans. So uh, you see the results, uh, football fans. Huh? You've seen it too, and I am too. We um, uh, it was the score of France four and Croatia got two. So, um, they have played a very great match. At the first half, they, mm, first half, they played, uh, scored three goals. Both teams scored three goals. And, um, France got scored two, then Croatia scored one. But then, second match, they, France started to, Score another two more than uh, Croatia scored uh, one more. So um, we have found the uh, another champion of the season this season 2018 of World Cup. So uh, one more time, congratulations to uh, all of the uh, France fans uh, and also. Uh, uh, we gotta stand and applaud for Team Croatia for having a great performance and also for their journey to this time. This is a uh, very worth a uh, game, worth a season of World Cup. So, um, 2018, we found the champion. Maybe we'll see who's the next one in 2022 at Qatar. Yeah, Qatar will be the next host of the next season of World Cup. So let's just wait for four years. Yeah, for an, uh, another four years. And if you can't wait that long, just wait for two years. And the next season, they kick off Euro, right? Euro 2020, they took place at somewhere. I forgot the place. I'm going to talk about that. Like for some of the next episodes, but I'm gonna be right back with the next part of the show. We're gonna do 
the lesson part of our tonight's lesson of our show. Tune in.